removal, disassembly, and cleaning on the compact breathing system for the CareStation 600 series. For more information, refer to the equipment's cleaning and sterilization manual. Remove the breathing circuit. Disconnect the bag hose from the bag hose port. Open the latch to remove the bag and straight connector. Remove the bag hose from the clip and the bag arm base. Pull down on the canister lifter handle to unlock the canister from the breathing system. Lift the canister and remove it from the canister lifter base. Open the breathing system door. Lift up slightly. Push the release button to unlock the breathing system. Grasp the breathing system base, rotate down, and pull the assembly away from the anesthesia machine. If there is not an integrated gas module, remove the O2 cell from the connector. Turn the bellows housing counterclockwise and lift. Push the side latches toward the center and remove the bellows and lower rim. Hang the bellows inside the bellows housing. Ensure the clear pressure relief valve is placed onto the bellows lower rim. Lift up and remove the entire bellows base assembly and seal. Push the patient port assembly tab and pull the assembly from the breathing system. Pull out both of the flow sensors. Remove the APL valve diaphragm assembly. The parts shown here are all autoclavable. O2 sensor, sensor cable, and disposable absorber canister are not autoclavable. Only autoclave parts marked 134 degrees Celsius. If there is no integrated gas module, connect the O2 cell to the connector. Install the APL diaphragm assembly. Press the APL diaphragm down into place making sure it completely covers the port. Insert the flow sensors into the flow sensor holders. Insert the patient port assembly. Align the breathing system base with the guide pins holding the breathing system at approximately a 45 degree angle. Rotate up and push the breathing system base to lock it into place. A click sound will be heard when attached properly. Close the breathing system door. Install the absorber canister and lift handle to engage canister with the breathing system. Install bag hose and connector. If your machine is equipped with a bag arm, place bag hose onto arm. Install the bellows base to the top housing. Align the vent port and press down on the bellows base to make sure it is installed correctly. Install the pressure relief valve. Attach the bellows with the rim to the bellows base. Press down on the bellows base and a double click should be heard when the rim is installed. 
pull up on the bellows to make sure it is locked. Lower the bellows housing and turn it clockwise to lock. Verify the housing is secure and the guidelines are facing forward. Always perform a perioperative checkout before using the anesthesia machine after reassembly.